Good morning, awesome people. Morning is a beautiful signs of hope created by our gracious Father to let us know that life doesn't end after the sunset. Every new morning is a new life, new hope, new joy, new faith, new grace, new strength, and new inspiration. This awesome morning, I want to capture my thoughts on like stars on earth, part one. Ishan decides to draw a picture on a canvas with colorful stripes. He can use two liters of paint to sketch the image. The canvas is rectangle with dimension of 1 meter high and 2.5 meter wide. How many liters of paint would be needed to paint a rectangular canvas which is 0.5 meters high and 1.5 meters wide? Hey guys, help us grow our channel by subscribing, sharing and hitting the notification bell for new inspiring videos. Like Stars on Earth is a heart-touching movie that emphasizes that every child is unique and has a special gift and that instead of comparing academic records, we should seek to find each child's strength and shortcomings in order to help them reach their full potential. The plot of the movie is around a boy named Ishan. He has problems reading and writing. He is believed to be dumb that his parent must send him to a special school. However, his life was forever changed when he met a gifted art teacher who helped him in discovering his hidden potential. The lesson is that every child has a unique gift and that academic performance is not a criterion to assess a person's potential. We should try to figure out what their strengths and limitations are so that we may help them understand their hidden potential. Being able to identify a child's interest rather than placing them in a box is a challenge for teachers and parents. We can't use the same approaches for every child. Every child has a certain level of intelligence, so rather than imposing, parents should try to identify their children's strength. They should endeavor to understand their interests, potential, and abilities. Romans 8 verse 19 says, For even the whole of creation eagerly wait for the revealing, the manifestation of the children of God. In what ways does our education system limit the potential of children? How can young people like Ishan not fulfill their hidden potential? Our deepest faith knows that we are inadequate. Our deepest faith is that we are powerful beyond measure. It is our light, not our darkness, that most frightens us. We ask ourselves, who am I to be creative, brilliant, gorgeous, talented, fabulous? Actually, who are you not to be? You are a child of God. Your playing small does not serve the world. This poem is by Marion Williamson. The Lord blessed you. The Lord caused his awesomely inspired presence to envelope you. And as always, may the Son of Man who passed through the clouds on to the ancient of days, may the one who placed stars in space and makes snowflakes like soft span lace, may he always inspire us to aspire higher. Before we aspire, have a super week and my name is Gideon Foley.